These are just some of the 450,000 heads of cattle set to be vaccinated in South Sudan. The aim is to combat seasonal livestock diseases and provide crucial food security. The government also hopes this will be the beginning of a thriving meat and dairy sector in the country. FAO started the vaccination in the mid of uh, April up to right now. So FAO managed to vaccinate about uh, 450,000 head of animals against uh, different diseases. The target of animals to be vaccinated around Benchu and Ripkona town is 100,000, but the teams will continue to vaccinate throughout the year. The Food Agriculture Organization's overall livestock vaccination campaign in South Sudan is expected to reach 6 million animals during 2015. We are very glad as community and people of this county. This vaccination is more beneficial to our people and our community at light. Because uh, if these animals are vaccinated, very sure that we, have, we should have health animal and health for productive family with important economic growth for this county. Due to the ongoing conflict, logistical constraints are many. With a population of 12 million people, South Sudan's human population has been outnumbered by cattle, goats and sheep which are at a staggering 34 million. Maria Galang, CCTV. An acute shortage of meningitis C vaccine could lead to a large-scale outbreak of meningitis on the continent. This comes after meningitis cases were reported in a large swathe of what is known as the meningitis belt of sub-Saharan Africa early this year. Health organizations have called on vaccine manufacturers to step up production of men's C vaccine by 5 million doses before the 2016 meningitis season starts in January. More than 1,900 people have died of meningitis since January this year, with more than 56,000 cases being reported in Nigeria, Niger and Chad alone, 25 African countries risk high infection rates. The problem that we are facing now is that if we, are, if we don't manage to, to, to put together this 5 million stockpile, uh, we will be not well uh, armed to respond uh, to, uh, to the epidemics uh, in, in, that may hit Africa next year. 